What's up guys, this is Dan with the Kill Battalion and I'm here to bring you a tutorial as how to uh, broadcast your Xbox Live party chat through Skype and using the VB cable on your Elgato. So this is kind of a little bit of a complex process, it's not particularly difficult, but if you're a little bit computer savvy it should be a breeze for you. So basically open, we have our Game Capture HD software and our Skype software. So um, down here you'll see this contact is my uh, Skype account that I have logged into my Xbox One. So if you don't have it set up on your Xbox One, get your Xbox One account set up, and then you're good to go, okay? Then after that, what you're gonna do is you're going to go in and create a brand new account for Skype on your PC. Um, just use a random Hotmail address or whatever you want. You're never gonna have to look at the Hotmail address. It's a dummy account basically made just to listen, and you'll see how that means in a little bit. Um, after you've made your new account and you've logged in on your Skype on your PC, with that account, you're going to go to your web browser, right? And you're going to do this VB audio software. I'll put the link in the description so you guys don't have to look for it like crazy people. Um, you're going to scroll down a little bit and you're going to get to this thing that says download right here. Okay? So what you're going to do is you're going to download this, this little driver. It's not a piece of software. You don't have to worry about installing anything on it. Um, it's just literally a driver and it's going to put up this uh, box here, which gives you this cable input for VB audio virtual cable. Okay? You'll see what that means in a second. So what you're going to do once you've downloaded that, now also once you download that, you may need to um, reboot it. Just keep in mind, you've got a 64-bit machine, uh, install 64-bit, 32, 32, and all that stuff. So uh, just keep that in mind. Um, once you get that all set up, you're going to go to Skype. You're going to go to Tools, Options, Audio Settings. Now right now, you see the speakers are set to my standard speakers, my Realtek high-definition audio speakers. Um, what you're going to do is you're going to drop down the menu and change it to Cable Input of the VB Virtual Audio Cable. Okay. What that's going to do is any voice or sound that comes through your Skype call that you make to anyone in your Xbox or your near friends is going to get recorded onto this dummy channel, okay? Um, it's not going to play out. It's not going to play on your speakers or in your headset or whatever. It's going to play to this dummy cable. So basically, it's picking up all your party's audio, okay? You're going to go down there. Once you change it, hit save. Then you're going to go into your Elgato, okay? Then you're going to go to uh, your audio input on your live commentary. Now, as you know, you can do game audio, which is everything that comes through your HDMI on your Elgato HD. Uh, your live streaming doesn't really matter. And your live commentary section. This is where anyone that would make comments through your headset or uh, whatever will get uh, picked up on your live stream or on your video recordings. So you're going to go in here and you're going to go to cable output. What that means is everything that comes in through your Skype, put, um, Skype phone call on that cable input is going to come basically out when you click the live commentary button uh, and play everyone's party audio in really clear, excellent quality uh, on your recordings and on your uh, uh, live streams through this cable output, this dummy cable output thing, okay? And you can obviously change the levels of your, uh, your voice and all that stuff, so it makes it a lot easier. Now, there's two things you need to know about this, two little uh, caveats. Um, one, when you make your phone call, you're going to call yourself on your Xbox and anyone else that you want to call on your Xbox, it'll pick up all you guys. So you hit this, you hit your phone call, you're going to go up and accept. Now, the only thing you need to know, I'm going to probably not get there, but make sure you go into your phone call on the PC and hit mute. Okay, so what that's going to do, really, if you don't mute that, everything that comes through um, your headset is going to get duplicated. Um, because you didn't mute it, so it's going to like pick it up and then pick it up again, so you'll have this weird reverb uh, kind of echoey thing that you don't really need, okay? So that's going to basically eliminate that, and in this way, using this method, you can record, uh, I think it's up to 40 people on your Skype phone calls. Now, I know in your Xbox One, you can get up to five or four. It's you plus a couple of just a few friends, but if you're like me, you have a whole clam with a whole bunch of people to play, um, you want to pick up everyone's phone calls. Um, everyone's voice, everyone's chatting, you know, it's, it makes the uh, live streams more, uh, more fun. So you just got to do that and, uh, and you're ready to roll. That should be, that should be pretty much it. Uh, okay guys, if you, uh, if you like what you saw here, uh, give us a like or subscribe on, uh, on YouTube. Check us out on Twitch as well. We're at twitch.tv slash the kill battalion. We do all kinds of live, uh, gameplay and, uh, all kinds of fun videos up there. And then, uh, check us out on Twitter. We're at kill battalion. Um, you'll find out when we go live on, uh, on Twitch and when we put anything up on YouTube. Uh, hopefully this was helpful and we will see you guys later.